is a book is like a portrait as opposed to a photograph. You know, a photograph, it's click, that's that. A, a, a portrait you layer on and layer on and layer on and mm. work over on for weeks. You still have the same single image, but there's this depth to it. And mm. a book mm -hmm. enables you to think and then rethink and mm -hmm. think and then rethink. And so you mm. can go deeper in a book than you can, I would say, in any other medium. Okay. But mm -hmm. that doesn't mean you can't go deep in a podcast. And it doesn't mean that there's no educational utility in 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 podcasts. Plus, there's audiobooks, right? And, mm -hmm. and sure. people are listening to those. Well, like that, that was another yeah. question. Do you think that audiobooks are just as valuable as books? Oh, sure. Just sure. as good. Well, the thing about the thing is, if, if you can really read, you can read way faster than you can listen. Mm -hmm. So reading is more effective. Except that, and this is what's cool about podcasts, and and what's what's game changing about them, I would say is. We can't read while you're driving. Yeah, sure. you can't read while you're doing the dishes or exercising. And yeah. so all of a sudden, with p the podcast world, people have all this time that was n used maybe listening to music, which is fine, right? Mm -hmm. But lots of people now are listening to like difficult podcasts. Yeah, well, educational. You know, ones. Yes, yes, yeah. and long, detailed mm -hmm. discussions about political issues that was never possible with television or even with radio, for that mm -hmm. matter. So, mm -hmm. and. You know, people say, well, young people have a fragmented attention span. It's like, well, yeah, but Joe Rogan does three-hour podcasts, and <laughs> right. those do just fine. And your right. podcast is how, how long you should? Long, long, two hours, yeah. 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 generally. Yeah. Right, so that's not for a fragmented attention. Sure. So, yeah. no, I but think it's good. You're absolutely right. I think the number one person who listens to this podcast and podcast in general are people who are occupied doing something else. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. And I think you're right. That's a really valuable to be able to utilize that space definitely definitely it's found time right. and so that's why the podcast market i think has exploded it's like mm -hmm. oh look i can make use of commuters you right. know people spend thousands of dollars a month in their time commuting mm -hmm. it's like poof all of a sudden you can make that hmm. you can you can take a university degree while you're commuting <laughs> essentially right. you know in terms of, of of the knowledge that you can attain sure. so i'm not pessimistic about that at all and That's also nice the way that you have been using youtube with your content is kind of amazing it's, it's yeah the way that there's hundreds of thousands of views on your lectures and yeah and they're difficult. They're, I mean, yeah, they're difficult yeah, lectures. Like they stretch, they push me when, when mm -hmm. I'm lecturing, and they're long. That's yeah. right. And there's a big market for, there's a big market for high quality, educational material. So, or I demanding think, educational material. Mm -hmm. Let's say.